Hey everyone, welcome to another edition of Rumor Roundup, and as with the others, all the stories contained within this are to be taken with a grain of salt and haven't been officially substantiated, but are things that are being talked about in the world of F1 that may be interesting, could turn out to be true, or simply plain wrong. Without further delay, here is Rumor Roundup. Daniel Ricciardo's future in F1 has been a hot topic for discussion and speculation over the last few weeks. Rumours have either been suggesting a move to Alpine or a sabbatical from F1. A new rumour now takes things in a different direction. I'm your host Dylan Shelley and first up on Rumour Roundup, Haas trying to sign Daniel Ricciardo. Many feel that now Daniel Ricciardo is leaving McLaren, Alpine will be his best option for 2023 apart from taking a year off. However, Daniel has history with the team during their Renault days, and reports at the time suggested that the two did not part on completely amicable terms. This is being suggested as a possible reason for some reluctance on Alpine's part. If Alpine do not want Ricardo, then his options are pretty limited, and that is where Haas supposedly comes in. As per a report by ESPN, Haas team principal Gunter Steiner has already been in touch with Daniel regarding this. This follows reports of supposed disagreements between Haas and their current driver Mick Schumacher. Additionally, Mick's uncle Ralph Schumacher also suggested to Sky Germany that Mick hasn't renewed with Haas yet and that he is a contender for the vacant seat at Alpine. Rapid Rumours Supposedly, Audi and Sauber have already reached an agreement. Seemingly, this deal will see Audi take a 75% stake in Sauber. This deal could allegedly be made official during the Spa race weekend or immediately following it. Alpha Tauri's team principal Franz Tost has refuted any supposed interest in replacing Yuki Tsunoda with Mick Schumacher. According to retired F1 world champion Nico Rosberg, the Prince of Monaco has seemingly intervened to keep Monaco on the F1 calendar for the foreseeable future. Alpine team principal Otmar Safnauer has heard rumours that Aston Martin made Fernando Alonso a very high offer. I don't know if it was a decisive factor. Ask him. Who should Alpine choose for their remaining 2023 F1 seat? Head over to my community page to vote in the poll and let me know what you think in the comments. And if you liked this video, feel free to subscribe and check out my others for all the latest in the world of Formula 1.